Hi, welcome to Thrive Personal Fitness. I'm Pamela Hernandez, your guide on the journey to health and fitness. Today I want to address a, a topic of conversation that came up on the Facebook wall. I asked people to tell me what their biggest challenge was when it came to health and fitness. And Jennifer, who follows us, likes us on Facebook, said her biggest challenge was portion control, knowing how to manage it and even what portion sizes are. And I hear that a lot. I hear that a lot from clients, from people I talk to, who write in, who post things on the forum over at our website, on Facebook, Twitter. You know, portions are really out of control in our society. And so it's really hard to know how much should I really be eating and how do I manage that? How do I make it easy? So my motto is plan, shop, cook. Um, you know, when you plan out your meals and you go grocery shopping, as you should be to eat a nice, healthy, balanced lifestyle, do the prep work before you start cooking. If you need to portion out foods, um, pre-cut vegetables, portion them out into proper servings, portion out your almonds into one ounce baggies, do it all ahead of time so everything's ready and you're not guessing and you know what it is you're eating so you can control those snacks when you need to grab something and throw something in your purse or you're really hungry when you come home from work and it's gonna be another hour or two till dinner, you can grab something that's already properly portioned out for you. Um, I also like to tell people to look at their plate as four quarters. If you can get a normal size dinner plate, not a giant size, but a normal size, you know, 12 inch, 13 inch dinner plate, Fill half of that plate with your voluminous, fibrous, wonderful, leafy, green, vibrant colored vegetables. Spinach, broccoli, cauliflower, carrots, gorgeous squash we have right now in the fall. Fill half of that up. Then another quarter is for your protein. You should always have your lean protein at every meal. So maybe that's your eggs, maybe that's a chicken breast, whatever your lean protein is, fill it in in that quarter. And then finally in the fourth quarter, that's where you can get something that's more starchy. Maybe some whole grain bread, some brown rice, um, even that's where your sweet potatoes or your beans should go. So if you can follow that method and stick to one plate, that's gonna help you manage your portions at home when you're making dinner for you and the family. When you go out, just always assume that that entree is going to be more than enough for you. Nine times out of 10, it will be. It's very rare and more, unfortunately, in the US to go out and get a properly portioned meal. So assume it's gonna be too big, ask for a box up front and split it in half so you've got lunch the next day, or do something that's gonna save a little money and just share a meal with a friend or your significant other so that you know you're keeping that portion size in control. So those are some handy tips to help you manage portion. Now, if you've got a question, something you just wanna know and would like some help or some advice on, you can post that question to our wall on Facebook. Go to facebook.com slash Thrive Personal Fitness. You can send me the question via tweet. Go to twitter.com slash Thrive Fit. Or of course, you can always email me. Send your questions to ask at thrivepersonalfitness.com. Thanks for watching today. Remember, every journey starts with the first step, and we'll talk again soon.